why do they say high blood pressure is a silent killer? Yeah, well, you, you don't know that you have high blood pressure by the way you feel. You just don't feel like, wow, today I've got high blood pressure. So yeah. it's a silent killer because it sneaks up on you. If you don't know it's there, it can cause heart disease, strokes, and kidney damage. Are there certain numbers when you take a blood pressure? Are there certain numbers that say you got to have blood pressure or you don't? What are the normal numbers? Well, normal is 120 over 70. So 120 over 70 is what you want. That's what you want. What do you not want? So you don't want 140 over 90. Above that, you got problems. So if it's between, you said 120 was the upper number. What's that called, the upper number? Systolic. Systolic, and the diastolic then is, is the, the bottom number. Is the bottom number. Well, then between 120 and 140, over 140, you don't want it. What's the different, what do you, what's well, the, we call that pre-hypertension. It's, it's not normal, but we don't, treat it with things like medication. It's not normal, you want it to be 120, but 140 is where we get much more concerned. So if somebody's got 132 over 70, uh, you would say, hey, we need to pay attention, what's going on with other problems, is that right? That's right, you okay. need to say, hey, so let's exercise, work on lose weight, exercise. Do things Dr. Bob says, to That's right. keep people healthy and eat right. Um, when the blood pressure gets to be 140, what do you tell the patient? We tell them to do what Dr. Bob does. We, we say exercise, we need to cut back on our fats, we need to eat fresh fruits, fresh vegetables, exercise. And the goal is you want to try to be healthy. I, I consider your blood pressure to be like a, it's a report card of your overall health. And so if you're not exercising, if you're not taking care of yourself, if you, if you got stress, if you're not sleeping well, all those things kind of add up on you. And so if you've got a blood pressure of 140 systolic, I'm gonna say, go home, work on these things, be a healthier person. And then do you bring them back and recheck and if it's gone down, you, you say congratulations? Yeah, absolutely. So what, generally what we do is look, start working on these things. If it comes down, no need for medication, you're living a healthier life. But you know, if it stays high, if you're not doing the things you need to do, that's when we have to start talking about you know, medications.